93.7 KLBJ, live from Aces Lounge on 6th Street for South by Southwest with Nigel and Bido. Do you get recognized more for the actor or for the musician? You know, right now, honestly, it's about a, a third uh, each. Uh, a third for E Street Band, third for Sopranos, and a third for being a DJ. It's getting wow. that big, yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's, uh, we're, you know, we had over a million listeners right now. It's really becoming that is a force cool. of nature, and you know. Who, and who do we just hear, by the way? That was the Cocktail Slippers, uh, all girl group from Oslo, Norway. Um, really cool band. I mean, they just been we they've been around for a few years. Um, we signed them on their last album, and we liked them so much that I, I just like said, you know, I'm, I'm gonna start producing again because. I mean, you know, what, sp- what else is there for you, man? You, you, you've, <laughs> you've done the acting. I mean, oh, the lots tour of things, of the man. World, lots right? of I things. mean, so w- tell us what what else besides well, you getting main, back into producing and the, the main, label well, and everything. Uh, well, that yeah, the label and, and producing and writing songs again is, is just is a fun part. Um, Business wise, our focus right now is trying to get a TV show on. That's our next main thing. No doubt. Yeah, that, musically that's, inspired. Yeah, it'll be like uh, I don't know if you remember a little bit before your time, probably, but Shindig, Hullabaloo. All the blue, sure. Ready, steady, go. It's just like um, what we want to do is bring back rock and roll. You know, originally it was dance music. And, uh, and, and, and we wanted to you know, remind people that you can dance to it again and have kids like on TV, live bands, dancing to it, young hosts. And it will be like a, you know, like a rock and roll dance party. You know. Well, let me know when the uh, the tryouts are for the host of that man. Please <laughs> let, let me know. For sure. Got any good yeah. scripts coming your way at all? Yeah. Any good you scripts? Know, I, I haven't even looked at them. You know, because I mean, we're going to be so out piling up probably the end of the year. You know, and I, I don't have much time. You know, I, I really don't. It's hard to commit to something like that. Sure. So, you know, who knows? Over the next couple of years, I might end up doing something again. But right now, it's just we're, we're fo- focused on the, on the business, making sure rock and roll. You know, is. You're doing a, your job you know, to save it, brother. That's what I'm saying. Well, we're certainly trying to get, become a niche again yes. in the marketplace so that these young kids, if they get good enough and they start making great records, they, they, you know, they deserve to make a living from it, you know, the same way we did. And you can't do that right now. It's almost impossible, you know. So that's worth spending some time on, you know what I mean? Like, pass that along if we can. So I know uh, during South By, you fly in, you had your day thing today, you're doing your showcase tonight at the Red Eyed Fly, it's Little yep. Steven's Underground Garage, and are these all hand-picked bands? For yes. Th- you booked this tonight Yeah, ha- half of them are from Wicked Cool, our label, and half we, pl- we play on the radio show. So, well, uh, where can people find out more about your label? Well, we got undergroundgarage.com, ha- has everything. Uh, you can go to wickedcoolrecords.com for the, re- for the label. And um, tonight's show is going to be live on iClips. Oh, uh, far out. Yes, yeah, on, on the web. So Very you can check cool. it out. You can actually go to undergroundgarage.com also. It'll be live there also. And, um, you know, it's going, to be a, it's going to be a fun show. Like, you know, we, we have some really cool bands, i, I got to say. You know? And the Underground Garage is nothing but fun. That's what we do. We we're trying to bring back a little bit of fun, right? I'm telling yeah, you, yeah. I, I had goosebumps before you were coming in. Not only, you know, respect for your acting and the, the producing that you've done, like we were saying. Me and Nigel are actually introducing Archangels tonight. Uh, that's cool. Down at Auditorium Shores. Right, that'll be fun. Yeah, but they, they, for what you do on, on the station, man, Little Steven's Underground Garage, filling that void that needs to be filled, returning yeah. rock to its roots. Yeah. yeah. It's important that we do both things because we, we play all the coolest new bands. And I know how hard it is for people to keep up. You know, and then you drop right. the history on sure. them, too. Everybody's busy. Yeah. But, yeah, so we play the top ten coolest records in the world, and it is worldwide. And then the other, you know, whatever, two-thirds of the show is all 60 years of rock and roll. And you, you always know? drop, like, the history about it, too, and everything, yeah. and tie it into what's going on today. I love it. Love it. Yeah, yeah. I mean, it's important to hear both things, new and the old, and, you know, young kids love it. Older people love it. I mean, everybody likes the show. So. How much time of your week is spent listening, previewing, mm. and uh, preparing new bands and, and, and deciding you know, what you're going to play? We get a lot of help. I, I got, you know, I got like 20 people working for me for, for, in all the divisions, you know, but probably six steadily on the radio show. And I still have to listen to uh, probably 20 albums a week. Wow. Uh, because we have That's a coolest a song in the world every week. This week it's The Living Things. Uh, and, and, and you can you know, check that out Sunday nights on KLBJ. Yeah. And I gotta ask, yeah. were you playing the piano late last night uh, at, the, at the Hilton Bar? I don't think that was him. I don't think so. You? Okay. <laughs> I mean, that wasn't him. Did you hear the morning paper today? People got arrested. A band got arrested for playing naked. 
on a piano <laughs> late up night. The, up at the Hilton. Up at the Hilton. Since when is that illegal? Uh, yeah, hey, exactly. I thought we were in Austin. Come on. <laughs> South by Southwest. <laughs> Thank you so much for stopping by, uh, man. You I know you know, you're, the best. Pleasure. you're just you're you guys one hell of a busy family. guy. You're part of family. Oh, Come on. Oh, oh, man. With a family. With family. That's so, crazy. So I'll see, you, Beautiful. Uh, I'll see you in a few weeks, right? A few months. What, what is it? That's April. right. You're coming in back April. April, April 5th. Oh, that's soon. Yeah. That's very soon. Cool. Looking forward to it. I'll see you then. And you will be live tonight hosting everything. I'm hosting. We're live, eight bands tonight. Eight bands. Including and picked from Stephen Bands. And headlined by the group we're about to play, the, the group that started the entire contemporary garage rock scene around 1980, and, they're, and they just made their best album ever called Psychedelic Sunrise. This is from it, and this is uh, Chesterfield Kings. We'll see you tomorrow. From Ace's Lounge, it's Beto, Stephen Van Zant, and Nigel on The Rock of Austin, 93.7 KLBJ. All right. From Ace's Lounge on 6th Street for South by Southwest 93.7 KLBJ.